Hearts of Iron, but the viewers choose what I do, part 25. I asked you how we should attack the Germans, and you voted that we should push into the Rhineland and capture German industry. Before we could launch an offensive into the Rhineland, the Germans attacked us in Russia. Luckily, we managed to hold them off. Then, out of nowhere, the South African attacked us. We were now at war with the remains of the Commonwealth. But as they are on the other side of the globe, they won't pose a threat. The Germans declared war on Luxembourg, so before they took over them, we launched our attack. The Germans fought fiercely, but we broke through and managed to encircle two tank divisions. After our success in the Rhineland, we moved to the north, where the Germans had less divisions. We captured Hamburg and Hanover, and even managed to encircle some divisions in Essen. The Iraqis saw the success of our military and joined our Mediterranean Pact. The Germans have not managed to reinforce their front around Hamburg. This means we can launch an invasion of Denmark to try and relieve some pressure off our Norwegian allies. We managed to capture all of Jutland but got stopped at the Danish islands. The war is going great against the Germans so it's time to think about how we should divide them after the war. We have five options. The first, we will disunite Germany and take the Rhineland. This is the normal one. The second, we will puppet the united Germany but we take the Rhineland and give Poland its normal borders. The third, we puppet a united Germany, but we take the Rhineland and give Poland some of eastern Germany. The fourth, we puppet Germany and give them all of the German lands except the Rhineland. The fifth, we take all of West Germany and give Poland most of East Germany. Remember, we haven't won the war yet, so some things could change. To vote, go to my channel and then to community posts, there you will be able to vote. Subscribe and hit the bell to not miss the next episode. See you there.